Suffolk YJCC hit the ground running. As soon as the governor shut us down, we began to talk about what services could we continue to offer and how we can meet the community need. Since day one of the shutdown, we've been serving meals curbside for our seniors. On a daily basis, our kitchen is preparing meals for anywhere up to 100 seniors a day. Some of those seniors are driving up to our curb and picking up meals, others are getting deliveries. We're preparing meals for seniors. Since we're in the situation of the coronavirus, they can't come in the building and get their lunch. So we're preparing pre-packed lunch so they can come here and curbside picking or some of the meals we deliver to them. We have some volunteers that are helping with that. This is so gratifying to be able to do that and to know that we're making a difference in the lives of these senior citizens who are not able to go out and get their food and their supplies. And it's unprecedented times and we all have to be there for our families and our friends and our community and strangers who don't have the chance that we can do to help. We're respecting all social distancing, making sure that we don't expose the seniors to any risks and making sure that they get what they need to stay safely in their homes during this whole epidemic. They are so grateful to the UJA and the YJCC. You guys at UJA is one of the best group of people I've ever met and encountered with. Unbelievable. It, it just can't put in words what the UJA is doing. <laughs>